Grace and peace to you, in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. My name is Eun Siu Kang. I'm one of the associate pastors of Riceville United Methodist Church. It is my great joy to welcome you to our Advent Daily Devotional Series. As we journey together in this holy season of Advent, it is our prayer that these devotionals deepen your faith and nourish your soul. This week, we are going to take some time to focus our heart on the true things of Christmas through Advent artwork. Today's artwork is The Nativity by Gary Melchers. This picture of the Holy Family is very different from what we usually see. No angels, no shepherds in this painting. There are no wise men, no donkeys, no camels, or no sheep. Instead, you will find a tired new mother and her thoughtful husband along with their extraordinary newborn baby. This scene could be happening either before the shepherds arrived or after they left. A faint light comes in from the open door, but most of the light in the room comes from the glow of the baby Jesus. It feels like a moment of rest, a quiet time before something begins about to happen. The arrival of the strange man from the east and King Herod's cruel act of killing innocent children. As Mary lies there, exhausted and worn out, did she think back to what she said to her cousin Elizabeth? She had a joyful and passionate song in her heart. My soul glorifies the Lord and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. Mary's song, known as the Magnificat, is an incredible expression of both worship and revolution. Months before the moment in this painting, Mary believed that the child she would give birth would bring freedom, justice, and peace to Israel. But now, she can barely lift her head to look at her baby. She looks hungry, humble, and very tired. It takes a lot of faith to believe Jesus will overcome sin and death. And it also takes faith to believe in the prophetic vision of Mary's song. Even Mary, in this moment of rest and darkness, had to dig deep and find all the faith she had to keep believing. Let this image of a tired yet faithful Mary inspire you like her, even when everything seems to point the other way, we can still hold on to our faith and believe. What do you believe 